DJ Uyunglele just across the six yard line. He takes off running. That was a big part of their attack last week against Miami. On the right hip and now to the left of Spencer Rattler. Quick throw intercepted. Jeremiah Trotter heading for the end zone. Touchdown, Clemson. Here's Trotter. When they put the back in motion, the defense moves, and I think Spencer thought Trotter would go in man coverage, but he didn't. He hung right in the throwing lane and picked off the throw. Typically, you think that linebacker is going to go with the back. He didn't go all the way with the back. He read the eyes of the quarterback, stepped right in front of the intended receiver, Nate Atkins, and turned it into a touchdown. Beautiful play, instinctive play by Jeremiah Trotter, who has really played well over the last three or four ball games. As has the defense. He's the son of Jeremiah Trotter Sr. We haven't lost here since 2016 when Pitt beat them on a last second field goal. Good pocket this time. Rattler. Wow. And it got what there in time. It looked like it might be picked off, but it was caught by Josh Van. As we said, started the day needing 40 for 1,000 this year. It'd be the 23rd time that a Clemson rusher has reached 1,000. At 128 yards against South Carolina last year in the game in Columbia. 30 to nothing, Clemson win! Uyunglele never saw the pressure from behind. Zach Pickens. Shipley, Shipley, he may go. Stumbled for a moment, it slowed him down and they catch him inside the 15 yard line. Here's where DJ likes to run also. And right on cue. Weaving inside the five and into the end zone. Touchdown, Clemson. So there's a man there, but DJ, as big as he is, he has the ability to make people miss. He doesn't look nifty. They take the flip to Jalen Brooks. They fire downfield, and what a catch by Josh Van. They haven't really tried that yet so far. Here comes a blitz. Rattler stepped up, fires down the field, oh my and a catch. Nate wow. Atkins, the tight end. With some of the other injuries they've had at different positions. Important drive for Carolina, trying to get back in the game. They run a reverse. Jalen Brooks has a blocker out in front, and he gets tripped up inside the five. R.J. Mickens saved the touchdown. Christian Beal Smith, the running back. Rather faked it to him, has time. Back in the end zone, touchdown. Juice Wells. Watch the protection. It's only five guys blocking. Rattler has time to allow Wells to get to the back of the end zone. Clemson at 31%. But there are several paths for them. Uyunga Lale could not get away. Swung down by Gilbert Edmond, the defensive end. Redshirt sophomore from Fort Pierce, Florida. Here's pressure! Rattler somehow got away, then got the throw off. The question was, was he down on a knee? The other question is, is it going to be grounding? I mean, it was a total domination from start to finish. Miami had only six first downs in that game. They are going to go to a little trickery of their own. Shipley handed it off. Oh, now the ball comes out. What and the, the ball is recovered by South Carolina. Maffa took the handoff, and then it came flying out of his hands. He was trying to ladder with somebody else. That's exactly what it looked like. Rattler throwing down the sideline, back shoulder for Brooks. Jalen Brooks gives South Carolina first and goal. Five receivers spread the formation now. Rattler danced away from Trotter. Spencer Rattler into the end zone for a touchdown. What an effort. What a great effort by Spencer Rattler. Again, there was quick pressure inside. Watch him step up, get away from the immediate pressure. That was Trotter coming on the blitz and then got it into the end zone. Outstanding individual. 
grow to appreciate how hard the job is on the field in real time. Uyunga Lee has his man. Collins trying to go off to the races. Darius Rush manages to chase him out of bounds. So it's Will Shipley, the running back. Third down and six from the 11. Clemson leading by two. Uyunga Lee has a man wide open. Williams, the touchdown. And DJ Uyunglele read the mistake by the South Carolina secondary. Three running backs behind Rattler. They go to play action pass. They have a man running wide open. What a play. Juju McDowell dragged down just shy of the goal line. They're going to spot him at the one. Graduate assistant coach, they activated Luke Doty, Jason Brown, to carry on Joyner. All started games at quarterback last year. Rattler started everyone this year. He's back in. He is throwing oh. a terrible pass. Horrible decision and intercepted by R.J. Mickens. Aiden Swanson had a key play in the first half. His 44-yard punt that got down to the two led to a safety. From the Clemson defense, bad punt there, caught on the bounce and on the run. Marion Brown out of bounds. Another outstanding punt return for South Carolina. Late in the half and turned it over. They're at the two, first and goal. Jaheim Bell to the goal line, touchdown. West Goon brought pressure. Wood has got there and had help as well. K.J. Henry finished him off. Here's Maffa untouched as he goes for 15 and more. Phil Maffa. There's some confusion on the Clemson sideline. And they're glad they ran the play because it's a touchdown. Will Shipley scored. A beautiful play by Will Putnam. Watch the center come off with the guard here and then come off on the second level on the linebacker. Starts out with the guard, goes to the second level on the linebacker, and that's all Shipley needed. And again, when he sees the goal line. One of the great all-around players on offense in college football. Will Shipley having another big day. Spencer Rattler wants to launch a deep one, and it is caught! Juice Wells all the way, touchdown Gamecocks! 72 yards! The junior from Richmond, Virginia. Well, Wells has been pretty quiet for the most part, but this time again, he's going to run a deep route. The staggered start, he gets outside, and beautiful job by Rattler finding him. Moving the launch point, giving the quarterback a little extra time, and then number seven does the rest. Hits his favorite target, beats Makuba on the play, and this time Makuba not able to make the tackle and prevent a touchdown. Probably having a lot of Gamecock fans wondering, where has this been? <laughs> Before the last couple of weeks, Rattler dropped for a loss by Jeremiah Trotter. And 25-26. From 35 yards straight on, good. And those of you who believe in the announcer jinx, remember that one. <laughs> There's eight career field goals of 50 yards or more, most in Clemson history. Uyango the lay for Allen, too long, and intercepted by Marcellus Dial. Trying to extinguish Clemson's playoff hopes and the 40 game home winning streak. Juice Wells needs the 35, and he has it. What an effort. And he's done the same to Dabo Sweeney, the Tigers. A lot of admiration. We talked to Dabo yesterday. I really like Shane Beamer, and I'm not supposed to like the South Carolina coach. <laughs> Thank you for watching ESPN on YouTube. For live streaming sports and premium content, subscribe to ESPN+.